my fellow Nigerians, I guess you must have come across this video trending online about Dino Malaye and the things we in talk concerning P2B. I just come to bring your attention to something because somebody cut out a section of that video concerned that to me. See, make I listen to from one minute to um, almost two minutes, 50 seconds. And I listen to it and waiting in talk there now about um, Peter B saying he wants to reduce cost of governance. So he was trying to say that cost of governance is not the problem of Nigeria. He was buttressing on it that Nigeria have so many other problems. Yes, I agree with you, Mr. Dino. Nigeria has so many other problems. And Mr. Pito B cannot come and solve all the problems of Nigeria at once. It's not possible. Nobody can do that. But at least, we need to start from somewhere. We need to start from somewhere. And this cutting cost of governance is a very, very critical issue. I am so shocked that you have to pick that point to make a speech on it. I am so disappointed in you, Senator Dilo Malaye, for bringing out this point about cutting cost of governance, that our problem is beyond that. No, our problem starts from there, to be precise. Our problem starts from there. Because you can't be paying senators the amount that even that is even more than the salary of the U.S. president. You can't be paying governors pension that is running into millions. And you are telling me that cost of governance doesn't matter? Bros, it matters. It really, 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 really matters. From there, it will tickle down to all other things. Just imagine, America is 1,000 times richer than Nigeria. Yet, we they pay senators more than what they pay their number one citizen. Their highest office. What we pay our senators is more than what... It's just like, just assume, say, as Dangote Day now. Dangote now the richest businessman in Nigeria, as we know, right? Good. And also, you get one small factory where they produce a pure water. Tough not business people. But now, Dangote now, they pay workers, let's assume, 70,000 Naira. You now, we be pure water factory man, they pay your own workers 150,000. Bros, will you survive? Will you survive? Can that business continue? You are paying more than you are producing. So we cannot go forward with this lifestyle. All these things they are saying, they are just trying to deceive you. If they come online, they go begin to blow grammar, they speak English, especially that way they call it mockery. They speak English here and there. Like say, we don't know what they talk. They're only coming to confuse you. I swear down. If they won't talk re re re, may they speak them for pigeon. That is our own language. That is the language of the heart. So that all man go understand. So that when they begin to talk those nonsense, you go understand what they talk. I just came to realize, say, I even get economic sense past Dino Malaye. Now, not just the same. I don't even know before. Because Dino Malaye cannot tell me that he, he can, we can afford to be paying these senators, these governors, this House of Rep members all over the country. Amounts that are far, 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 far more than what other richer countries are paying their people. Which means we are not ready for business. All these politicians, go look all of them. If not for government money, they can't even do any form of business. They cannot even do any business again at all. If you give them that small meshai shop where you get for your village, that small um, kiosk, they cannot even manage it and make profit. They cannot manage it and make profit because they are that poor, that daft, that intellectually poor. If not be government money, they no go see sheshe. If not be government, because I see no reason why you elect a governor since 1999 until today you are still paying him. For what? That's no more election. That's a, that's a um, employment. So my people, you have to be watching out for this kind of people. We know them. We are watching out for them. There is no good thing that can come out from the devil. So if they like, come to them and preach to you that this, that, 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 they are all in the same shoes. So be careful and don't fall for their pranks.